it's uh, Renee with Canthracise with Renee B. We are working out on the ground. You will need some special equipment today. You will need two paper plates. Um, paper, if you got them. Um, if not, and you're on, a, if you're on a hard surface like the wood back here, you can use um, towels because they'll move. So you can just put your feet on the hardwood floors or linoleum with some towels that will slide. Um, the point is we're going to slide, so we're going to do a creative core workout today. Have I practiced it? No. Will you see firsthand what it's like for a struggle? I am a fitness instructor. I should be practicing all this stuff ahead of time to make it look more professional, but I want you guys to see that working out is not perfect and that we're just working out to get ourselves stronger mentally and physically to get through cancer and chemo and surgeries and all of that stuff. So. Um, I want you to see, because you see so many of those workout videos and those people look fantastic and they have great abs and da 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 and they make it look so easy and it's not. It's a struggle. We really have to work hard to get the um, mindset set up to work out. And um, as much as I enjoy it and how I feel afterwards, it's, it's still a battle for me. And um, as important as I know it is and how much I know it's helped me through chemo and stuff, it's still a battle for me. And I still have abs, and I still have large thighs, and things jiggle, and I have cottage cheese. And that's because my body is real. My workouts are real. My body's real. I'm real. There's nothing perfect about me. There never will be. I just go out there, and I do what I can do, and I keep trying. And that's what I want to encourage in you is just to keep trying and to go for it. So we're going to be working core. Imagine that core because... Uh, I won't be able to in a couple of days, so you all know this. So two paper plates, doesn't matter what size. Um, we're gonna get in a plank position, okay? And I want your feet, and we'll probably have to take breaks with this, okay? So up on your planks, here we go. And I want you to bring one knee in, like a mountain climber, okay? Keep breathing, abs are engaged. You feel that? I do. All right. Let's rest and relax. It's a little bit hard because we're up in this plank all the time. Whew. And again, not perfect. Catching my breath. Okay. Now we did single legs. Now we're going to do both legs at the same time, okay? So get in that position. Make sure you're sturdy and stable. Your uh, hands are underneath your shoulders like a plank. And we're going to go. You can try for eight, maybe ten, okay? So, catching my breath, trying to remember to breathe, up, eight, huh? okay, eight's good, <laughs> Whew. stretch those arms out a little bit, working those shoulders a little bit, because, you know, planks work the whole body. So we're really working those lower abs by those workouts, those exercises. Okay, now we're gonna go up into, um, we're gonna bring both of our feet up and we're gonna kind of fold in half and then legs out, fold in half, legs out, okay? So you'll see. I'm sure there's a technical term for it. <laughs> I don't know it. All I know is it's a good workout. So here we go, ready? Whew. Shoulders relaxed, abs are in, you're breathing. Got water handy, right? So come up with your plank. So we're gonna try to bend. Whew, it's hard. Relax, right? <sighs> Goodness. So, I need a shower after this. Gotta get my laundry started, which is stairs. Yay. <sighs> All right, so we're gonna get back in that plank and we're gonna do our legs out to the side, okay? Just one at a time. 
and uh, we got a couple of knee ups and uh, we'll be pretty much done. You can do it a couple of times around, okay? So get in that plank and your leg's going to slide out while you're bracing yourself on the other one, okay? Something like this. straight, isn't it? Yeah. Now, all right. So, catching my breath. Working that ab, working that core, working those obliques, working our arms actually too, aren't we? From the plank, getting our heart rates up from a very simple exercise. Simple. You got to keep your balance. It's a little tricky with that part. If you need to, um, put your foot on the floor and only use one plate as we're doing these side ones to give you a little more stability so you're not sliding as much, okay? All right, let's do this other one. Oh, goodness gracious, you guys ready? And up we go. more. Woo! We did it! Okay, now I'm going to get a little up close and personal here because we can do uh, legs out at the same time, like splits in a way. So, we'll see if I can do this or not. I may not be able to get my legs very far apart because I'm not as flexible as some, but I am very real, and this is me being real with you, okay? Up in that plank. Breathing. Let's try two more. Right? Maybe? <laughs> okay. Woo! All right. Working those outer hips and thighs. So we're doing pretty good. All right, let's go back to mountain climber and then we're going to stretch out and call it a day, okay? So let's nice thing is I can just toss my paper plates away when I'm done. All right, you guys ready? Let's see if I am. And up. Oh. Thank you. 
Three more. Three, two, one. Release. Oh, goodness, come back into child pose. <sighs> breathe, breathe, breathe. Stretch. Oh. We're going to do a little side stretch for our quads. Okay. Leg out. Whew. So much fun with leftover paper plates from a party, right? Hug that knee. Whew. Let's switch it out to the other side. As we work those quads, excuse me, work those arms, work those abs, work those obliques and those hips and our inner and outer thighs. Whew. Do it twice through. You'll be sweating up a storm and feeling it, trust me. Yeah. All right. Feet, heels together. Stretching out that inner thigh, a little bit of that hip. Breathing, breathing, breathing. Right? Yeah. Stretch. And we got the other side to do. down a little bit here to get that stretch in your hip going. And we stretch out those arms and those shoulders that we worked. starting to really see my hair, aren't you? It's getting darker and thicker on top. It's like growing into a flat top all by itself. <laughs> and out. And then stretch those shoulders. Straight up, stretch out those abs. Breathing to get our heart rate back down. Let's bend over and get those obliques. And other side. And shoulder rolling, rolling, rolling. Right? All right, you guys. Thanks for joining me. Uh, happy 4th of July to you. Happy Independence Day. Uh, hope you're celebrating safely. If you have the day off, if you're working, thank you. Uh, military, thank you too. Um, talking to your doctor, listening to your body, right? You could do more reps of those. That's great. You can do two or three rounds. Go for it. All right. If you need to just do one leg at a time and keep the other foot flat on the stable surface, do that too. You're listening to your body, doing what's right for you. Okay. You're hydrating with lots and lots of water and we're fighting and we're fighting for ourselves we're fighting for stability of our mind. We're fighting for stability of our body, okay? And you know why we fight? Because we need to prove to ourselves that we are stronger. You are stronger. Have a great day. Love you. See you tomorrow.